how to use zigzag exchange quick and easy tutorial hi guys welcome back in this tutorial i'll show you how to use zigzag exchange so let's get into it first of all what you can do is you can go to trade.zigzag.exchange and you will get right here zigzag exchange is one of the very famous exchange out there that allows you to trade crypto in order to get started with zigzag you will have to connect your wallet so you can find the connect wallet option here and then we can also find it here when we are entering our details so i'm going to click on connect wallet and then we can connect any type of wallet we got so i will be connecting my metamask today so my metamask is connected you can see right here make sure to select your network first we have arbitrum available for metamask so i went with this one how to add arbitrum to your metamask there is already a video on this channel you can go ahead and check it out so once the wallet is connected we're good to go now i'll show you how to trade with zigzag exchange before we begin the video i just want to clarify that this video is not a financial advice and i'm not a financial advisor trading in crypto buying and selling crypto involves a high degree of risk or whether you afford to lose money or not so make sure that you truly understand crypto and you have all the information you need and then you can get started with zigzag exchange so let's continue uh, once you are here on zigzag exchange you're going to switch to the trade option and then we have to select our tokens from here the pairs so in pairs we have this one right here then we have these are on arbitrum we have worth in usdc wbtc usdc and others so what i'm going to do is i'm going to go with this one this is going to be my pair once you select the pair then you will find the live price of your pair right here this is the live price then we have 24 hour change 24 hour high 24 hour low and 24 hour volume given for both of the tokens that we have selected we have selected wbtc and usdc moving on this is where we will be working but before you click on buy or sell or you actually buy and sell you will actually need to read the chart right here so for the chart you can see we have here then we have market trades given to and order book so this is going to be the order book and market trades here we have again selected BTC and USDT and we can also compare it with any other uh, symbol we want. But we will not be comparing because I will show you like a simple trading. You have to select the time. Uh, we have 1 minute, 30 minutes, uh, 45 minutes, 1 hour or 1 day. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the daily view to see what happened throughout the day in 24 hours. We can select the kind of chart we want. I went with candles, then we have indicators. We have indicators, bar lines and more. And at the bottom, you will find a bunch of other options. So this is where you will read the chart and you will kind of see like the highest price, the lowest price for your pair that you have selected. And you'll see how it's going. If it's going up now, if it's going down now. So what's happening with the pair that you have selected? You will read the chart. Once you are done with reading the chart, then you will move right here to the buy and sell option. So on zigzag, the trading is really easy. There is no complicated thing and we can use it for our simple trading on different exchanges, especially on Arbitrum network. So we have buy and sell. I'm going to go with the buy first and then we have two options when it comes to the buy. We have limit and market. You can switch to the limit or you can go to the market. I'm going to select limit here. Then you have to select your price. So this is actually the price right now that we have for this pair. Then we have to enter our amount in WBTC. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to like maybe enter 1000. So this is what I will be getting. This is going to be my available balance in my wallet that I have. You will select your percentage and you will click on buy WBTC. Like the amount you want to buy, you will enter it right here. Of course, uh, why I am entering WBTC because it is the one that I am buying. When it comes to the network fee, it depends on your other pair, your network that you're going for. Then we have the market. In market, you don't need to select the price here. It is going to be according to the market. Then we have sell. Again, the details are going to be very similar. The details you add for buy, the same details you will be adding for the sell. And you will enter your amount here, the total, percentage, sell, and network fee uh, right here. Now I'm going to scroll down a little bit and show you this is going to be where you will find your open orders, your order history, all of the balances that you have, all of the transactions that you have already done. You can go ahead and enter it right here. Similarly, we have our indicators here that you will check out. 
Then we have some of the layouts that we can go for when it comes to the order book. Checking the order book is also an important step. Now what I can do is I can actually switch to the pairs here and we can select different tokens. It depends on your network that you have selected. I went with Arbutrum. Uh, moving on, we also have the wrap option right here that you can go to and it will open up in a new window. If we want to go for a comparison, then all you need to do is you will just enter the symbol right here and add a comparison so that you can compare before you start buying or selling with the zigzag exchange. If I enter some amount here to buy, let's say I have a hundred. So you can see network fee is going to be uh, this one right here. We have 802 8 USDC for this one right here where we are actually getting 1 million uh, USDC. So what I'm going to do is uh, if I go with like 1 then we have 16,000. Uh, 1 WBTC uh, will give me 16,000 USDC. It's equal to 16,000. And uh, the network fee is going to be $8 uh, for this transaction. This, so it's not that much uh, right here on this exchange. So this is actually pretty impressive that we're getting this fee and we will be able to buy. You can see we also have like favorites. So if you click right here, your uh, pair that you have selected will be added to your favorites and it will be added to your watch list and you will be able to track it really easily uh, similarly we have settings right here in settings what i can do is i can do some settings for the chart that we have and we have our settings for the stack order book so i'm going to actually get rid of this and it will show me like this so we can select the layout from here too this is going to be your language and then we have our trade option so this is trade.zigzag.exchange go ahead and check it out right now to buy sell and trade on iBootroom and other networks we also have some stables right here of uh, if you're looking for stable coins then you will find the stable pair here then we have wbdc and the one that you add to your favorites will be added right here like for example if i add this one to my favorites and if i go to the market then it will be added right here so it really helps us to create our own watch list uh, similarly we have a pair here for ethereum we have wbtc and all so these are all the ones that are available in which these tables are included all of them are actually stable uh, on exchange so yeah guys this is how you can go ahead and check out zigzag exchange it's a very easy to use exchange and allows you to trade crypto so yeah guys this brings us to the end of the video i hope that i was a big help to you and now you know everything that you wanted to know and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if this tutorial was a big help to you i tried to do everything about the topic and i hope that you understood everything and now you are good to go and don't forget to uh, share this video with your friends and family members so they can also get the information they want to also you can subscribe to the youtube channel the button will be given right down below go ahead and subscribe to the youtube channel also hit the notification bell so every time you get notified when we post a video so yeah also leave a comment down below what was your favorite part and what did you learn from this video or if you have any question